Hello students, welcome to my YouTube channel. Now I'm going to solve another analysis problem in gravimetry. Now here is the problem. Orthophosphate is determined by weighing as ammonium phosphomolybdate. This is the formula of ammonium phosphomolybdate. Calculate the percent phosphorus in the sample and the percent diphosphorus pentoxide if 1.1682 grams of precipitate were obtained from a 0 0.2711 gram sample. So we have here our sample containing phosphate ion. We treat this, we dissolve this to convert our sample into a form suitable for chemical analysis. Then we add a reagent that can precipitate phosphate ion as ammonium phosphomolybdate. Now, the fact that the precipitate is ammonium phosphomolybdate, then the, re the reagent added to our sample is the molybdate reagent. When precipitation is complete, the solution is filtered to separate this ammonium phosphomolybdate precipitate from the filtrate. And then we wash thoroughly with distilled water our precipitate to completely eliminate all water-soluble uh, substances that co-precipitate with our analyte. And then we dry this in the oven to completely remove uh, moisture. The end product of this analysis is the dried ammonium phosphomolybdate. And the mass of this precipitate is 1.1682 grams. Now to solve the problem, First, we have to identify all given and what is asked in the problem. So given in this problem are mass of sample equals 0 0.2711 gram, mass of precipitate uh, 1.1682 grams, and we are asked to solve 4% phosphorus and percent diphosphorus pentoxide. To solve 4% phosphorus, we are going to use this formula. Mass of, uh, mass of phosphorus divided by mass of sample times 100. And to solve 4% diphosphorus pentoxide, we use this formula. Okay, so mass of diphosphorus pentoxide divided by mass of sample times 100. But since the percent phosphorus is, also, is already given, then we can also solve for percent diphosphorus pentoxide using uh, this formula. Okay. So, percent diphosphorus pentoxide equals percent phosphorus times the molecular weight of diphosphorus pentoxide over 2 times 30.97 grams of phosphorus. Now, solving for percent phosphorus, but before that, let me solve first the mass of phosphorus. The mass of phosphorus is equal to the mass of ammonium phosphomolybdate precipitate times this factor. This Factor converts grams of ammonium phosphomolybdate to grams phosphorus. Now substituting the value, to grams phosphorus equals 1.1682 grams of ammonium phosphomolybdate precipitate times 30.97 grams phosphorus divided by the molar mass of ammonium phosphomolybdate, which is 1,876.38 grams. Grams, uh, grams ammonium phosphomolybdate, grams ammonium phosphomolybdate cancel. So the mass of phosphorus is 0 0.0193 grams. Now percent phosphorus equals 0 0.0193 divided by 0 0.2711 uh, times 100. And the answer is 7.12% phosphorus. Now we can solve 4% diphosphorus pentoxide. And this is equal to... Uh, 7.12 times 141.95 grams of diphosphorus pentoxide divided by 2 times 30.97 grams of phosphorus. And the answer is percent diphosphorus pentoxide is 16.32. Now notice I multiply uh, grams phosphorus here by 2 because 1 mole of diphosphorus pentoxide contains 2 moles of phosphorus. Now, I hope you understand my explanation. Now, if you like this video, please like and subscribe. Okay, thank you for viewing and thank you for listening.